Hi, welcome to Sophia's Art Supply Review. I'm back again after a break with some new products and honest reviews. Today I would be reviewing the Brustro Artist Metallic Gouache Paints of 18 Colors and also doing a small demo with the product. So if you're new to the Metallic Gouache Paints, it should give you a starting point to begin experimenting with the product. Now I have reviewed several Brustro products including the Brustro gouache tubes as well as the Brustro watercolor tubes. So if you're new to my channel, don't forget to check these reviews out after watching this video. As for my regular viewers, you'd know that I have a love-hate relationship with the Brustro packaging. While the prominent black packaging is definitely eye-catching and does dominate over a clutter of well-established brands, it is, however, harder to distinguish between each product within the Brustro basket. The outer packaging is made of thick cardstock paper with two slits which allows you a sneak peek into 16 of the colors that lies within. The other two colors remain a mystery as there is no swatch card on the back. Once you remove the paints from the box, you'd see that the tubes are arranged in two rows within a thin plastic tray that rests in a paper container. The styling and design of the tubes are similar to their watercolor and gouache counterparts, with black being the prominent color and a strip indicating the color which lies within. On the tube, you have the color name and the color number. There is a tiny box here that indicates the transparency of the paint, so a fully filled in box means that the color is opaque and a partially filled box shows that the color is semi-transparent. And of course, unlike watercolors, gouache are valued for their opaque quality and hence you will not find any transparent colors here. Each tube contains 12 ml of paint. These paints are also ASTM and EN71 certified which indicates that they are safe to use. Let's proceed to do a swatch test to check how these paints perform on paper. On the onset, the color range in this set is quite impressive. There are color blocks here which would work well for paintings where you're looking at slowly transitioning from one color to another, for example in a calligraphic writing or a wreath painting. The opaqueness is also extremely good on white paper, but on black it may require you to apply another additional layer. I must add here that the paint is extremely smooth to work with and there is no grittiness that one may expect due to the mica pigments which are present in the paints. I also like the names of the colors as they sound quite unique and refreshing, especially names like Pinkalicious, Metallic Mint and Sunburst Orange. Now let's do a small demo video to test whether these paints live up to the expectations or not. I really like the pinks, the oranges and the blues here, so let's do a floral painting with some color transition effects. The paints are extremely smooth and buttery in texture and it's easy to push it around on paper. The color is also mixable so it's fairly simple to create more shades. They are also quick to dry so one can go back and add new layers without worrying about accidental smudging. The opaque quality of the paint allows one to go back and redo areas that one is not satisfied with. As you can see here, I have covered up an entire section quite effectively. Overall, I would give the Brustro Artist Metallic Gouache a thumbs up for its smooth creamy texture, quick drying property, the variety of colors and its superior metallic sheen. If you enjoyed this video, do click the like button and do subscribe to my channel to watch an art supply review every Wednesday.